Hey, congratulations, man. We're going to attempt to take this cover off for you. If there's instructions, I haven't read them. We're going to wing it, but I promise you we'll do it right. Got your fourth vet from me here at CorvetteConti.com, and it means a lot. Looking forward to seeing you again, man, and you're going to love, love your new Stingray Corvette. Congratulations. All right, it looks like everything is basically Velcroed, uh, some little plastic tabs in different areas, and uh, some bungee cords. That's really, really all it is. So I don't know if there's any sequence we're supposed to do this, but let's just start un unraveling it as, as we go here. A couple plastic tabs underneath here. This one's actually taped down to the windshield. Okay, some Velcro right here. Tape down on this side as well. Tabs out there. I'll put back in there. There's a couple just little plastic bungees. You see down here, nothing fancy, nice and easy. For those of you who don't know yet, yes, you do get to keep the cover. It's just a real temporary cover. I already started tearing a couple spots, so I don't know how long you're going to keep it, but it still adds some mystique and uh, some fun to the to the Stingray. Here underneath the front fender, it's like it's just uh, elastic. This one comes off like that. This one as well. Just a big elastic, just kind of wraps underneath. More bungees in the back here. You gotta be real careful when you take this thing off. Make sure no debris up underneath of it. You don't take some of the hard plastic parts, you don't want to drag that across the car either. It's coming off pretty easy. Windshield's really just taped on there. Nothing too fancy in that regard. But it's a little thicker than packaging tape. Those of you who are wondering by looking at this car trying to decipher what it is regular body coupe, not a Z51. We'll be putting up some nice pictures of it because it's a beautiful combination. 2LT night race blue with Kalahari interior. Don't forget on the 2LT you're still going to get some nice Kalahari stitch in the top part of the door panel, up on the dash which we'll show you, inside your steering wheel, around the shifter. Very, very nicely done. Assuming it comes off. Yeah, that's a heck of a 
lot easier than me trying to take it from the top corners. trying to show the interior while I was doing this, but I told you I was winging it. This is a hard plastic piece in here, so you want to be careful with this so it doesn't go across the paint and scratch it you know, as far as rubbing down on it. But, uh, just from initially taking it off real quick, the paint looks great. Again, if the guys at Bowling Green are laughing right now, I don't even want to hear it. I told you, I didn't read the instructions manual. They're probably like, Rick, you're supposed to have the hood closed. Yeah, whatever. It's coming off, isn't it? There you go. You wonder why it takes so long to ship these things? How long was I screwing around with that? 10 minutes just to get it off? First time, not even knowing what I'm doing, so I wanted to give you a, a real impromptu. Pictures coming up. Thanks for joining us.